Hello students, in this video we will discuss about the first experiment in digital design that is familiarization of Xilinx 14.5 tool flow. Objectives After completing this module, you will be able to list the steps of the Xilinx design process, simulate an FPGA design by using default software options. Overview of the Xilinx 14.5 Xilinx ISC Integrated Synthesis Environment is a software tool from Xilinx for synthesis and analysis of HDL designs, which primarily targets development of embedded firmware for Xilinx FPGA and CPLDs integrated circuit product families like Spartan, Vertex, etc. ISC enables the developer to synthesize their designs, perform timing analysis, examine RTL diagrams, simulate a design's reaction to different stimuli and configure the target device with the programmer. Other components shipped with the Xilinx ISC include the embedded development kit, a software development kit and Chipscope Pro. The Xilinx ISC is primarily used for circuit synthesis and design, while iSIM or the model SIM logic simulator is used for system level testing. The procedure to be followed for software and hardware programs as follows. Create a new folder on desktop with your class number. Here I am creating a new folder. Name class. Select and double click Project Navigator to open and invoke Xilinx 14.5. Go to File menu and close any previously opened projects, if any. Go to File close project and open a new project click on file new project enter the file name or project name and location here I am writing the verilog code for AND gate so I am giving the file name as AND gate and location you have just created on your desktop and top level source type is HDL click on next and here product category is general purpose family Spartan 6 device XC 6SLX45 package CSD324 and speed is minus 3 and click on next and finish right click on the source file and select new source select verilog module from available options and give the file name as your entity name I am giving and gate and click on next Here we have to define the ports used and their directions. Here I am giving the inputs as A comma B as inputs and C is your output. They give the direction as output and click on next and finish. Write the Verilog code in the workspace that gets opened and save the code here I am writing the code in data flow model for AND gate sign C gets value of A A and B and saving the code now we have to write the 
test bench for the AND gate. So right click on the source file, select new source and select verilog test fixture and give the file name as AND gate underscore tb and click on next associate the pre previously written verilog code and click on next and finish. Here in this window we have to give the input stimuli. Now I have written the stimuli here a equal to 0, b equal to 0. After 100 nanoseconds a equal to 0 and b equal to 1 and after 100 nanoseconds a equal to 1 b equal to 0 and, and after 100 nanoseconds a equal to 1 and b equal to 1 then save your file next step is to go to design tab and click on this implementation radio button and click on this AND gate and go to process window and double click on synthesize XST and expand this synthesize XST and double click on check syntax correct the errors if any After check syntax, double click on the view RTL schematic. In this view, you can see the representation of your design in terms of generic symbols like AND gate, OR gate, adders, etc. And next step is now double click on view technology schematic. In this view, you can see the design in terms of logical elements like LUTs, buffers, IOs and other technological components. Here the LUTs are the LUTs expanded and you can see the AND gate symbol. Inputs are I1, I0 and output is O. The e e equation and truth table and K map of the AND gate can be seen in LUTs. So th these two are the input buffers and this is the output buffer. The next step is simulation. In the design tab go to simulation window and click on and get underscore tv and go to process window expand iSIM simulator and double click on simulate behavioral model to, to the see the output for the given input conditions. Now it gets the iSIM window. Opens the iSIM window. Here th this is the iSIM window. Now click on the zoom to full view. And here the first transition. A equal to 0, B equal to 0. The output is 0. And another transition. A equal to 0, B equal to 1, C equal to 0. In another transition. A equal to 1, B equal to 0. C gets value of 0. And the last transition a equal to 1 b equal to 1 and output is 1 the truth table of the and gate is verified by using verilog code in data flow model in a similar manner write the code for all basic gates in three verilog hdl modeling styles that is data flow gate level and behavioral thank you